I'm the Tony Rich Project, and um, it's an honor to be here tonight to induct myself and Lloyd Price. No, I'm just kidding. Lloyd Price into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. Lloyd Price is a man who did everything right at a time when what they call race records were not supposed to cross over to pop charts. Lloyd wrote Laudy Miss Claudie and taught taught the kids a lesson they never forgot. That record still sounds pretty ram today. Can you imagine what it must have sounded like in 1952? Truman was still president, and here comes Laudy Miss Claudie. Here comes rock and roll. See, Lloyd never stayed in his place. Just when the public had him pegged as this wild R&B singer. <laughs> hey, come on, is my vision getting bad? <laughs> <laughs> going too long. He did personality, a whole other thing, a very smooth pop sound. Nobody knew what to expect from this guy. He could do it all. Maybe the most important crossover Lloyd made was on the business side. So Lloyd moved across the desk. He set up record companies and owned radio stations. And did you all know that Lloyd, myself, and Don King put together the Ali Foreman fight in Zaire? Y'all never knew that. <laughs> I'm just kidding about Don King. It was just me and Lloyd. But, uh, <laughs> all right, okay, Don, you can have it. Lloyd took control of the means of productions. He's a very smart man, as we all know. I know you want to, uh, you know, get Mr. Price up here, and, but just give me a moment more. It's a little hard doing this without instruments. I can't leave without saying something about Stagger Lee, the original gangster. Stagger Lee was such an, an important record, it took a real slice of violent ghetto life, a true story of a murder over what? My hat. That's why I have this baseball cap on. My hat is missing. And Lloyd, I want my hat back. <laughs> Not so far from shooting somebody for his Nikes, Lloyd took that true story and said, don't hide this. Don't be ashamed of this kind of music. Take it right out and show the world. Stagger Lee was a whole new kind of subject matter for the radio. I can't say for sure, but I kind of suspect that Stagger Lee made possible Hey Joe by Jimi Hendrix and Down by the River by Neil Young and a whole lot of hardcore rap that Mr. Price might not want to take the rap for. It's not your fault, Lloyd. You opened the door. You're not responsible for who followed you through. But you sure do deserve a lot of credit. And on behalf of all of us who followed you in, it is my great privilege to welcome you into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <clears throat> Thank you, Tony Rich, and thank you, ladies and gentlemen. It's really, really a pleasure to be here. But if Dave Bartholomew did not have the foresight to drive out to Kenner, Louisiana, and hear me saying, Lord and Miss Claudie, <laughs> this night would have never been. And <clears throat> I want to thank those of you who worked so hard to, uh, to get me here tonight, you know? It's been a long time. Jack Newfield, <laughs> Lance Freed, Alan Klein, Phil Spector, uh, Bobby Weinstein, Mark Freed, Alan Grubman. The list goes on and on and on and on. I want to thank you, and I want to thank those of you over the years who have supported me and my music. I appreciate it. And I wrote, a lot of you think that I should have been here sooner. <laughs> but what a night this is to be inducted with such wonderful group of people. I'm honored to be inducted tonight. And I thank you. I want to thank my brothers and sisters who are here tonight, and my lovely wife, Jackie, uh, who's here tonight. She better be here tonight. <laughs> and all of you who have supported me, 
This is a wonderful night to get on, and I thank God, and with God's speed, let us try to make more music so the world can sing our songs. Thank you very much.